Thank you very much. <clears throat> all the dignitaries on the dais and all the delegates and all the uh, learned speakers who have enlightened us on various subjects. And I'm so happy that I have the opportunity of delivering a keynote address and also meeting many of you and many of my senior colleagues who have been with me for the last more than three decades and we have traveled together. I think it's a great admiration for Dr. Mishra to have brought India into the international scene and in the scene of the world. Uh, training and teaching is one of the very important part of any technology, more so for the technology which are so-called highly technique-oriented. And I'm so happy that we have got uh, something like this. I think you know, some of the uh, groups which are known, but I think this is the most admired group of teachers in, under the uh, leadership of uh, Dr. Mishra and his team, which has really had a deep impact in training and teaching of our young colleagues and also not so young colleagues because technology is moving and on all of us we see that uh, things change from time to time. What is the gold standard today? Tomorrow something else may come. As, uh, as the technology is progressing. In last decade, the technology has really progressed very fast. And all of you who have trained here should feel proud that you have been trained in a center of excellence with the best possible training uh, pattern and protocols uh, which has been established by Dr. Mishra, who has dedicated his life in training and teaching because this creates a win-win situation. When we have a trained surgeons and trained doctors, ultimately the patients are benefited and the society is benefited and the family is benefited and of course, finally the country and subcontinent is benefited. His uh, training center is not only popular in India, Dubai and uh, US. I think what is most impressive is that it is a persistent progress of the institution. And uh, this is what I admire and uh, with uh, great dignity and respect for him uh, and my best wishes, my salute to him for making it happen in the country and also all over the world. So, and uh, also very interesting uh, uh, days of collecting the knowledge and having the learned speaker expressing their uh, views and also letting you know what recent things are happening place. And thank you so much and also thanks to dignities on the, uh, the dais who have come all the way to be present during this and providing good wishes for this particular event. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Uh can I request Dr. Arti Sareen to please uh, say a few lines? Ma'am is the Director General at the Armed Forces Medical College. Uh, very good morning to everybody here at this WALS conference. It's the 8th Congress and uh, we are very happy to represent a small section of the armed forces which is present here. Dr. Chaube has already spoken about the association and Dr. Mishra's contribution to it. My um, laparoscopy has come a long way. I first experienced it during my internship where we only saw in 1986 diagnostic laparoscopy and then how it moved on. Dr. Chaube has educated so many including my husband Admiral Nairu, who has also, you visited us in, uh, when we were posted at Ashwini, encouraged all of us. A lot of uh, armed forces personnel have learned from you. Dr. Mishra is doing a wonderful job of training. 
not only people from India, but all over the world. So we should really uh, appreciate him for that. Without taking much time, I would wish the Congress the very best for all the deliberations and the discussions that are going to happen, that have already happened. And uh, best wishes from uh, all of us at the Armed Forces and the Ministry of Defense. Thank you.